Okay, question nine is a fairly typical question for GCSE maths. We're told that Matt and Dan cycle around a cycle track. Each lap that Matt cycles takes him 50 seconds, and for Dan it's going to take 80 seconds. Dan and Matt start cycling at the same time at the start line. After how many laps will they each have cycled when they are next at the start line together? So at what point are they at the starting line at the same time? Well, that's going to happen um, when these two times seemingly overlap. So I'm going to, it's essentially a lowest common multiple question. Now, there's many different ways to do it. I could work out the lowest common multiple of 50 and 80. Some of you might know. One of the easiest ways to do it, though, is to just list out all the multiples of 50. And then we're going to follow that by listing out all the multiples of 80. I'm going to stop at 400. I have a hunch. And then I'm going to list out the 80 times table. So we have an overlap at this particular time. That means they're in the same place. Now, how many laps for Matt was that? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight laps for Matt. And that's going to be one, two, three, four, five laps for Dan. And there's a fairly straight straightforward way to get your three marks.